I'm sorry, how's everybody doing? I don't as much speak the language as I impersonate it. Oh, it's so good to be back here in Egypt performing for the first time. Thank you, no, thank you, seriously. I have to tell you, I grew up in the United States, okay? And when I, when I used to come here, I used to come here every summer. And everyone would always say, are you American or are you Muslim? Right? They'd always say that. And I would say, I'm American. And they would go, is your father Muslim? And I would say, yes. And they would go, you are Muslim. <laughs> and then the next year, I would come back and they'd say, are you American or are you Muslim? And I would say, I'm American. And they would go, is your mother Muslim? And I would go, yes. And they would go, then you are Muslim. So as I started to do comedy, I started talking about being Egyptian and living here and, and having my friends here. And the moment I started doing that, every Egyptian stood up and said, you can't do that, you are American. <laughs> so hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoy the comedy. Um, it's very difficult performing for the Middle East because a lot of people, especially Egyptians, they have a lot of pride, right? They don't want anybody talking bad about Egypt. Only they can do that. <laughs> If you ever sit with a group of Egyptians, they'll be like, oh, the pollution, oh, the traffic, oh, the people. Yeah, it is kind of hot. Don't you guys talk bad about me? Because you can't just talk to you So I will talk about being Egyptian, but growing up in the United States. Um, my original name is not Rami. My uh, original name is Sheher. Yeah. All my friends called me good at pretty much. <laughs> but I had to change my name, as so many Arabs do, because it's common knowledge if an American can't pronounce your name, they will change it for you. <laughs> but they're like, Abdul Rahim, what? I'm just calling you A. <laughs> my favorite is when they change Muhammad to Mo. <laughs> like you changed your name from the Prophet to one of the three stooges. <laughs> Come on. And please be careful what you name your kids. No matter what nationality, no matter what ethnicity. I was at a Denny's, uh, which is a diner, and this waitress, this black waitress, comes up to me, and her name tag says L A Q U E F A. Yes, yeah, so I was like Laquifa. That is an interesting name. She throws down the plate. She's like, Uh uh, it's Laquia. The F is silent. I was like, well, up me. <laughs> because honestly, I think black people are the most creative with their names. 